In today's video, I'm interviewing longtime client Ashley Wright. Ashley runs Smash Cactus Media, a creative agency that focuses on providing thumb stopping videos to their clients across TikTok and Meta. Before working with us, Ashley struggled to get consistent leads in the pipeline, leading to periods of famine and feast, which hampered his agency's growth. Since working together, we've been able to generate Ashley well over 100 qualified calls, allowing his team to close over $70,000 worth of new deals. All right, guys, welcome back to another client interview. Today, I'm here with long-term client Ashley Wright. Ashley, can you give us a quick introduction who you are and what you do? Yeah, sure. So yes, I'm Ashley Wright, founder of Smash Cactus Media. So we're at an organic creative agency helping brands scale across Meta and TikTok. Awesome. And, you know, we've been working together for quite some time, but prior to working with me, I mean, how were you generating leads for the business? Yeah, time's flown. Uh, so yeah, so previously it was kind of everything in terms of like from an ad hoc perspective, trying to do a lot. We were obviously not getting much results so obviously we did a bit of cold email myself ran a bit of ads uh, obviously we've got some inbounds coming in but nothing was ever consistent in terms of the flow of everything so obviously that's the reason why obviously we would look to kind of close the gap in terms of being able to get more consistency coming in through the through the doors yeah so you were struggling with consistency getting in regular meetings booked onto the calendar and then you know not being able to then bring on regular clients to the business as well um, and yeah, one thing, you know, that. I've been working with you for like over a year now. And the one thing I've yeah. noticed with yourself and your business is how much you've, you've grown in this past year as well. It's been it's been really, really cool. Um, so could you give a sort of quick insight into what the results have looked like with us working together, you know, in terms of closed calls, um, you know, how many calls have been booked and sort of revenue generated from, from working together. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, so like I said, time's it's definitely flown by, but I think in terms of time we work together, we've done easily over a hundred calls in the, the space of, I think it's been like 13, 14 months now. And since then we've obviously closed 70, nearly 70K worth of revenue. So again, awesome. as you imagine, not all deals are going to close, but it's all about playing the long-term game, which obviously we kind of knew from the start in terms of getting into this and obviously it starts to pay off in the long run and you're also in the e-com industry as well um, as an e-com agency you know you provide multiple services within that but it's a very very competitive industry to be yeah. in um, lots of agencies there's a lot of competition out there um, so it's been amazing working with you throughout that time period and and getting the results that we have and, and getting you that extra 70k in revenue um, it's been really really cool so, you know, with us working together, obviously we've worked together for quite a long time. So I hope you've had a good experience. Um, but could you give a little bit of insight into, you know, what it's been like working together? Have you enjoyed the experience? I mean, how has it been working uh, with our agency? Yeah, definitely. I think I would go all the way back to when we kind of started. And obviously, I always say I always want to work with people who obviously walk the walk. So obviously, you can imagine you get a lot, like a lot of emails, a lot of DMs from people saying we can do X, Y, Z. But then you look at the same example there on Twitter, say we can get X amount of followers, but they've got 200 followers or they're doing this and that. And you're like, well, you can't do yourself, but you're actually trying to sell it to me. But the thing that stood out when you obviously cold emailed me was obviously the email was on point. And like I said, I get so many different cold emails. So the fact that stood out, I knew straight away, look, this is definitely worth having that conversation. Obviously, when we jumped on a call, obviously you kind of laid out in terms of what was going to be done, the whole flow, everything. And it just perfectly made sense and just aligned in terms of timing wise and the offer and everything. And then from then onwards, just, yeah, it's just been a really, really easy process. I feel like the good thing with you is you don't, you're not like a yes person. You would obviously like push the boundaries in terms of whether it's like supporting to tweak the offer, um, obviously giving feedback in terms of where the offer and obviously showing the emails and obviously kind of just working that flow from your side. So I think it's from my perspective, it's been more of a partnership, I would say, rather than uh, a one way thing, which obviously that was kind of the thing we kind of went into. So like I said, you kind of like say you don't just talk the talk, we definitely do walk the walk for sure. Awesome. And it's kind of refreshed my memory a little bit with how I originally reached out to you. And um, I remember <laughs> being pretty relentless in my follow ups to get you on that call. So <laughs> Uh, yeah, yeah exactly that right so it works. it's one, one of the things you kind of have to do in cold email you have to be relentless for your follow-ups it doesn't matter if it takes you know some of the meetings that we booked for you guys you know i've looked <laughs> back um on how many emails it took to get that meeting i mean some of them are over 30 emails that we've sent oh, yeah. um after they've right. initially yeah. responded just to get them onto a call uh so yeah it's 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 it really is a game of being relentless consistently following up and and just making sure that no leads fall fall through the cracks so yeah. no i, I yeah, appreciate it's, it's appreciate, appreciate those kind of words um okay awesome so i mean last question uh just to sort of wrap everything up you know what would you recommend for anyone who is in your position 
prior to working with me, he was struggling to generate leads, wasn't getting consistent leads through the door, and then wasn't able to to scale to the level that you wanted to scale that you have been able to scale, you know, prior to prior to working with me. Yeah, I think the main thing is obviously giving it a chance. And I'd say, like, like I mentioned, there's a lot of people out there who would say they can do it, but the proof's in the pudding at the end of the day. You want to trust people like yourself who obviously can do it. And I would say give it give it a chance. Obviously, the, the the lucky thing in terms of when we work together, obviously we've got results pretty much straight away in terms of closed deals. But I was always in the mindset, and I think that's what a lot of people need to be in terms of that. Look, you are going to have to maybe send a when you're already going to send a lot of emails. You're going to probably get some no shows. You're going to get some call that don't show up. But yeah. when you look at the longer scale of things, especially in a more competitive niche, that these these people are getting emails so often so if you can get on these calls these people then it's a great opportunity that you might not get in terms of you are doing other stuff or trying to do it on yourself so i would say literally give it a chance but be patient it's probably one thing for it because like i say it will reap the rewards and the things you don't as a agent who don't need a lot of clients for it to work make sense financially as well which is the main thing so just be patient let it kind of do it's what needs to be done and then yeah just kind of go from there already and, and what i would say as well with working with you um, is that while I've been working on one area of the lead generation, you know, cold email is only cold email so far as cold email is only cold email. Do you know what I mean? It's, it's, a, it's a singular process. Um, working with you has been great as well because you're always coming out with interesting offers, exciting offers, different offers. And outside of just the cold email, you know, you have been building a personal brand, whether that's on LinkedIn, whether that's through your email list, your, your newsletter, whether that is through Twitter, you know, you've grown rapidly. You, you already had a good personal brand when I first joined, uh, when we first worked together. But in the past year, you've sort of skyrocketed that. And something I talk about a lot on my YouTube channel is having things outside of cold email that overall help your ecosystem, building that ecosystem together to support it so that if someone gets a cold email from you and searches you up, you know, they're seeing LinkedIn, they're seeing Twitter, they're seeing whatever it is so that they know that you're a real person and that you're an expert, a subject matter expert in what you do. So it's been, it's yeah, been a real yeah. pleasure working with you and getting these results for you as well. Yeah, no, it's been a pleasure. And like you say, it's definitely the thing, like I say, people are always going to search for you. So yeah, definitely having that proof there in the background in terms of who you are. And like I say, again, I always say in terms of personal branding, put the content out there, put the work in and don't expect anything back in return because the fact is you'll jump on a call with someone who's really big and then literally they've literally seen all your LinkedIn posts, all your Twitter posts and then literally it's kind of already a closed deal before you even like had to even open your mind. Mouth, sorry, so yes, yeah, so it definitely is worth definitely putting that in, in the, the back, background as well for sure. I completely agree. Completely agree. Awesome. Well, thanks for jumping on, Ashley. Um, it's been a real pleasure, pleasure working with you. Pleasure speaking with you. And uh, yeah, excited for what the future has to hold for for both the businesses. And uh, yeah. yeah, me too. Thanks. Cheers. <laughs>